Hi friends. Let's review our addition and subtraction algorithm and our wording to keep in our brains for when we are adding and subtracting multi-digit numbers and either um, regrouping or getting to the next place value. So let's start with addition. Let's use a nice big number to start. Let's get some random digits in there and we'll do sure, lovely. We know we're always gonna start in our ones place and move to the left. So seven plus four is 11. We are going to put our ones place down the bottom and we are going to regroup our 10 into the next place value. So when we are adding this, we should be saying in our brains, three plus zero plus one 10 is four tens here. Ones place, tens place. And we're gonna keep going. Eight plus five. 13, we put our three from our ones place down here and regroup our 10 into the next place value. 6,000 plus 1,000 and another is 8,000. And we are going to remember our comma. Remember, if you don't have a comma in a big number, it's incorrect, it's not a true number. We can go one, two, three place values and stick our comma. Now, for subtraction, we are still gonna use our regrouping wording. We do not borrow anymore. Borrowing says we're gonna give it back, but that's not what we're doing. So we are going to regroup our tens and our ones if we need to. And we are going to come up with a little, um, kind of a sing-songy remembering our steps. Let's see. Let's try here. If we have 5,347 minus 3,090, we are still gonna start in our ones place. And we're gonna make sure each time we move place value that we are allowed to do the subtraction. If your top number is not the bigger number, you cannot subtract something small from something big. So we would have to change it and we'll show you when we get there. Seven minus nothing is seven. Four minus nine, I don't have enough. So I'm going to do a little cross cross and we are going to change our three hundreds into two hundreds. We are going to regroup them in our tens place and we are going to change the four into 14. We regrouped 10 tens and gave it to the tens place. 14 minus nine is five. Let's check. Two hundreds minus nothing is still two hundreds. Five thousands minus three thousands is two. I'm gonna come to the side of my number. One, two, three place values gets a comma.